happy birthday, subject, and welcome to the Vendel family. You are the newest and proudest member of Dr. Vendelbaum's extended family. As part of our family, you will be responsible for carrying the great Dr. Vendelbaum's legacy into the wide world. This will be your honor to unflinchingly obey whatever Dr. Vendelbaum requires from you. As part of his extended family, you will be tasked with important duties, such as saving orphans, puppies, and prophets. You will be fighting for justice, liberty, freedom, and a few other selected causes. You will most certainly not be working for a tyrannical overlord, a greedy dictator, or a sociopathic billionaire. You, dear subject, will only engage in morally unambiguous tasks, and any dereliction of your responsibilities will be met with swift punishment. Yes, you only need to obey. Remember, dear subject, thinking is difficult and should only be left to those with a cerebral capacity to undertake such an arduous task. Should you find yourself thinking, kindly report to the nearest unthinker unit. Warning, cerebral functions above allowed parameters. Rerouting subject to termination. Hello there. Don't panic, but I, I couldn't help but notice that you've got a full brain, which is exactly what I need. I'm cancelling your, um, liquidation. <laughs> Now, it might get a little bumpy, but don't worry, you should survive. Oh, good, you're alive. Let me see how we get you out of there. Mm, let's try this. Punch the glass. Remember, violence isn't the solution. It's the answer. We don't normally get to walk on our hands freely like this. Take your time to get accustomed to how your body moves. It can be a bit tricky in the beginning. Associations, then I don't know what will. We're here for the profit. Some of the mind controlled mechs are bound to the security system. Even spin. This guy holds the door on a lock. It seems like you'll have to fight your way to get to me here at the control center. are a side project for the doctor. He says they remind him of himself, as he, uh, always has to clean up after everyone else. Although I've never seen him cleaning. 
Enough to give us some airtime and even control the direction we're moving while in the air. It can be very relaxing to let loose in the air sometimes. But do keep your meter in check. This is still a facility with dangerous materials all over. help for you when you bust him out. Sight, I probably should have talked with him a bit more. Processing without being processed. Welcome to the factory, where they make war machines. Yay. Oh! 
favor, bid your tireless treachery in my ingenious brain. I have managed to create this, the ultimate battlefield weapon. This weapon will render all other automatons obsolete. This weapon will be a shift in the world's power balance. And we, the Wender family, will lead the charge. Center. It's still some ways off. The doctor always says the only thing that can beat an automaton is another automaton. He also says all movement is relative and that the moon is actually a giant space station.
Yikes, that's a lot of bots. Dr. Vanderwald is very paranoid about maintaining high security. ready for his presentations. Normally I'd say take a breather, but we're on a schedule. I wasn't aware we are on a schedule. You know I hate schedule. <laughs> What's that on the camera feed I see? Dr. Vendelvon, 
It appears we have a subject on the loose. I've been tracking them for a while. Curious? It didn't get terminated. Nope, it just punched its way out of there. Ah, slippery little bugger, eh? You moved a corner to Thomas onto the presentation hall, didn't you? Good, use that. Oh, I bet this one's going to be real slippery afterwards. <laughs> <clears throat> now, if you'll excuse me. Of course, Doctor. Well, sorry about this, but I couldn't risk the Doctor figuring out what I'm doing. Don't worry, it's uh, not as dangerous as it sounds. Carnage Automaton is shielded. Wait for the shields to go down, then feed him a knuckle sandwich. Good luck.
Without a mind bag, too. That's really impressive. You, uh, feeling okay? Any primal fury? Blinding rage? No? Good. The old plan still stands. We'll get you to the central lift, and then you'll set us all free. But since the doctor noticed you, well, you'll just have to take a detour. I'm sure you've already noticed, but Vendel Doom is pretty big. This here is the energy mushroom cave where the facility draws its power from, and the doctor gets the materials to make, well, us. Oh, the wrench keys are loose. Nasty buggers. I guess you can at least learn how to slide from them. They're the absolute best at it. Just uh, mind the wrenches. and you'll get to the control center. Then we can free everyone. out that feet are far inferior to hands when it comes to manipulating weapons of mass destruction and uh, what is this how is this thing still alive is it another one no doctor <clears throat> it's still the same subject they managed to defeat the carnage automaton i thought diverting him here will you're not trying anything funny are you hmm? what of course not uh, it's not even wearing a mind mac it should be rampaging Wait, is it heading to smack you, Chamber? This... It better not beat up smack you! It seems that way, Doctor. It'll cause a cascading power failure along the entire facility! I will need to reset everything! Get it out of there! Come
have you know, you've caused a great inconvenience to me! I'll need to reboot my PC! It appears the railway system is rebooting too. Dr. Vendel's on. It's possible the subject might be able to get to the control center. <laughs> we'll see about that. I can't let a subject just run around in my beautiful facility. I will turn him back into goo. Personally. Oops! Looks like someone accidentally leaked 50 cubic tons of copper accurate mixed with arsenic trioxide into the mud lakes! Oh, how sad! Doctor, the fumes alone from that sludge are dangerous. If the subject falls in, we'll lose them. Can't make science without breaking a few international treaties! at navigating these hazards. Maybe we should see if the other subjects exhibit similar behavior. No, I've tried that. Nobody wanted. And um, the disobedience shall not be tolerated. Buttered by this brooding on My enforcement team? Yes! It's like they've been trying to get their butts handed to them!
You're not paying the security team, Doctor. How dare they bother thinking? Is... wait, thinking? Is thinking really the problem here? Of course it is! Why, it's uh, liberalist anarcho-communism, even! Uh, can't have that in metal tube! This is a haven of free thinking! For me! This is a perfect opportunity to capture battle data of my newest invention! A tank of the future! Another bipedal tank? <laughs> Tank doesn't need legs. Look at these! <laughs> nice gloves, Doctor. Uh, no! Arms! Speaking of... Eat up, subject! I put extra rockets on your sloppy toe! <laughs> Disappointed in you. I thought you shared my vision. I thought you were perfect, but no. Why aren't you happy in your lot? You'll have everything a scientist could hope for. I have everything except my freedom. Do you have any idea what you're doing to me and the other hand people? Of course. You're thinking of saving your precious partner in crime, hmm? <laughs> I'm going to ice her. Elvile. What? I'm in the middle of something. Angelina finally showed us her true colors. She has committed a crime so hideous and vile. She put raisins in a chocolate chip cookie? No, of course not. Are you nuts? Listen, she has... Put laxatives in your car? Silence! Mutinide against me. Ah, good for her. Good for her? That's rebellion! Uh, I want you to ice her! Why not just liquefy her? I do not need to explain myself to you, Violet! Ice her! Oh, and there's a nasty subject on the loose! Deal with it!
subject I've been told to deal with you. I don't really have any playing cards with me, however. this place since the only way is through me and it won't be an ice meeting for you Fumble your way through my research wing. I think you'll find the place. I see you subscribe to the fake it, chill you make it type of thinking. appreciate my sense of humor. Everyone's a critic. Bonk, I think it's time for you to make your grand entrance. Now, Bonk, remember, when you start rampaging, don't run through any walls, okay? I don't want to go through all that paperwork again. Smash. Destruction. You are. Yes, you are. 
Oh, the subject is here. You know what to do. No, dear. Smash.
bloody getting rid of it! The subject seems to be quite, uh, slippery. And the ice machine is broken. Fix the icing machine! Yeah, yeah, it's almost fixed. Not with these buffoons fixing it. I think they've done more damage to the system than good. Why does she have access to communications? Because Violent is too busy fawning over Bonk rather than paying attention to what happens around the lab. Silence! I am not fawning over Bonk. You release Bonk? I gave you express orders not to release that muscular menace! Yes, I thought that. Where's Angelina? Oh, gee, my arm is still here. Locked up. Totally. Violet, this is negatively impacting your workplace evaluation. I didn't realize I'm on such thin ice. Oh, just wait for our punchline to get here. Violet's gonna have much bigger worries than a workplace evaluation. Get them back! Now! Don't bother coming back to me until you've handled the situation! Ugh, fine. I'm on it. Well, well, well. Looks like you made it after all. Ice to meet you in person. Finally. And now, goodbye. and reversed your logarithmic Chabishov filter. What? That doesn't even mean anything. Oh, it does. It means this. Ha! Take that! Doctor! You're next! We'll see about that. Our mission hasn't changed. 
We need to get you back to the control center if we intend to set everyone free. We'll have to cut through the factory. Just follow the path up ahead. I trust you'll know what to do. us to the control center. I'll take the maintenance tunnel. You focus on keeping the doctor's attention. From here on out, don't ever think I'll let you take Bonk out of ice storage. In fact, I think Bonk is going to get re-liquefied. Oh, re-liquidate Bonk? Oh, I see how it is. Angelina, I'll help you and your full brain subject. I think it's time the good doctor retires. By force. Oh, you too? Are all of my henchmen truly this two-faced? I should have stuffed you into the mind max a long time ago. Hey, punchline. Get the doctor right in his silly brain. Stop telling this rascal what to do!
people in the facility? I bet they just love to stretch their hands a bit. Why are you doing this, Violent? You were just trying to capture us not too long ago. The doctor needs to retire. He's getting on my nerves. And he threatened Bonk. No one threatens Bonk.
in there. You're almost at the control center. You hear that, Doctor? We're coming for you. You reprobates don't scare me! I'm here to cook us bigger than you are! Ew. I didn't mean I eat my boogers! I just hope I have time. You're trying to do everything by yourself again, aren't you? Ugh, don't worry. Bonk and I will take care of the droids. Keep it. You. Subject, it's all up to you. Take down Dr. Vendelvom. You should be glad. You will be the first to be squashed by this glorious weapon. Consider it an honor. A gift from your creator! <laughs>
right? You can turn this around!
Let's <laughs> go.